How are you kids? We are now in week 6. Visualizing decimal numbers using models and renaming decimal numbers to fractions. The numbers that has that after the ones digit is called decimal numbers. These digits after the ones denoted tens, hundreds, and so on. Decimal number can be changed or renamed into fraction form and vice versa. After going through this lesson, you are expected to visualize decimal numbers using models like blocks, grids, number lines, and money to show the relationship to fractions. You are also expected to rename decimal numbers to fractions whose denominators are factors of 10 and 100 to decimals. The 10 cubes represent the whole. 6 out of 10 cubes are shaded cubes. This can be written as 6 tenths or 0 0.6 or 6 tenths in decimal form. The denominator as 1 zero. It tells you that there is one digit after the decimal point in the decimal number. Grid is another way to visualize decimal numbers. You can observe that there are 100 squares. This means that the whole is equally divided into 100 each, 100 squares. There are 12 shaded out of 100 squares. The 100 squares represent the whole. 12 out of 100 squares are shaded squares. Can be written as 0 0.12 or 12 hundreds in decimal form. You will notice that 12 hundreds has two decimal places. Decimal number can be also visualized through number line. There are 10 posts which represent a whole. Out of 10 posts, there are 3 painted posts. That is 3 tenths. This can be written in decimal form as 0 0.3 and 3 over 10 in fraction form. Look at 25 centavo coin. This can be written as 25 hundreds in decimal form or 25 over 100 in fraction form. Here are other examples of decimal number to fraction form. Observe how decimal numbers rename to fraction form and vice versa. Five tenths in decimal, five over ten or five tenths in fraction, and the lowest term is one half. 4 tenths. 4 tenths in fraction. 2 pip is the lowest term. 8 tenths. The lowest term is 4 pips. 9 tenths. In fraction form, 9 over 10. And the lowest term is 9 tenths. How about two decimal places? 25 hundreds in fraction form, that is 25 over 100. One fourth is the lowest term. 50 hundreds in fraction form, 50 over 100. And one half is the lowest term. 40 hundreds. 40 over 100 
and the lowest term is 2 pips. 35 hundreds in fraction form, that is 35 over 100. And the lowest term is 7 over 20. Learning task 1. Show the following decimals using grids. Number 1, 9 tenths. Number 2, 1 tenth. Number 3, 24 hundreds. Number 4, 21 hundreds. Number 5, 1 tenth. Number 6, 15 hundreds. Learning task 2. Show the following decimals using number lines. Number 1, 2 tenths. Number 2, 8 tenths. Number 3, 1 tenth. Number 4, 4, 5 tenths. Number 5, 8 tenths. Number 6, 9 tenths. Learning task 3. Show the following decimals using cubes. Number 1, 7 tenths. Number 2, 9 tenths. Number 3, 1 tenth. Number 4, 2 tenths. Number 5, 8 tenths. Number 6, 5 tenths. Learning task 4. Rename the following decimal form into fraction form. Number 1, 75 hundreds. The lowest term is 3 fourths. Number 2, 35 hundreds. The lowest term is 7 over 20. Number 3, 90 hundreds. 9 tenths is the lowest term. Number 4, 80 hundreds. 4 pip is the lowest term. Number 5, 9 tenths. 9 tenths is also the lowest term. Number 6, 60 hundreds. The lowest term is 3 pips. Number 7, 15 hundreds. The lowest term is 3 over 20. 95 hundreds for number 8. The lowest term is 19 over 20. Number 9, 36 hundreds. 9 over 25 is the lowest term in fraction. Number 10, 16 hundreds. The lowest term in fraction is 4 over 25. Number 11, 50 hundreds. The lowest term is 1 half. Number 12, 49 hundreds. 
4900 is also in the lowest term. Learning task 5. Rename the following fraction form into decimal form. Number 1, 5 tenths. Number 2, 8 tenths. Number 3, 20 hundreds. Number 4, 43 hundreds. Number 5, 5 hundreds. Number 6, 65 hundreds. 7, 60 hundreds. Number 8, 18 hundreds. Number 9, 75 hundreds. Number 10, 80 hundreds.